when him and Catherine had their first date, I remember he was still living up by the speedway. And I remember when he called me and he told me all night long, he said, I'm gonna marry that woman. Said, there ain't no way you're gonna marry her. She ain't gonna stick around that long. <laughs> you know, if, she, if she's that good of a woman, she's not gonna hang out with you for this long. But here they are. <laughs> Logan, I'm so very thank thankful that you've brought the joy back in my best friend's life. I've never seen her have so much fun with anybody. And I can honestly say I do know more of you than I want to know from Snapchats and, and phone calls. Um, but I know you two are picture perfect, and I'm glad she has you to carry her through the rest of the hardships in life. I've seen more of a change in you in the past couple of years, and I know neither myself, Emily, your Nan and Paul, any of your friends here or other family members here, we can't take credit for that because all of that credit comes to Catherine. Thank you for always being my best friend, my biggest fan, and the best mom I could ever be blessed with. You're always showing me how to be a strong, independent woman and mom. Today, a bride, tomorrow, a wife, forever, you baby girl. <laughs> I truly say she's my sister because I feel everything that we've encountered together was around the same time. We've both had heartbreaks um, together. We um, lived the single mom life in nursing school. Um, we both lost the most important men in our lives. Um, around a year, our dads both passed away. And then we found our soulmates. And we're so very thankful that we have each other and we got through all that together. We got more memories together than I could ever fit into how long am I allowed up here? Five minutes or so? You know, we we butted heads for about the last 23 years. It took him being this far away for me to realize, you know, everything he means to me. That's my big brother. <laughs> We are gathered together here in the presence of God to join together this man and woman in holy matrimony. Our Lord declared that the man shall leave his father and mother and unite with his wife in building of a home and the two shall become one flesh. Who would have thought a match on Tinder would lead to what we have today? And who would have thought you'd be crazy enough to drive 194 miles to meet a guy who you barely knew? I think about that every day because I'm so happy you took the chance. You have changed my life forever. Makes me come I can start crying before I even read it. <laughs> <clears throat> the day we've been waiting for is finally here. I cannot believe I get to marry you. I am overflowing with excitement and joy since the moment you've walked into my life. You have been a safe place. The way you love me is unlike anything. Oh. The moment you got out of your car, I knew we were gonna have something special. Do you remember how nervous I was? 194 miles, that's crazy. We never missed a weekend. We made the drive no matter what. It didn't matter if it was raining or we had six inches of snow, we made the trip. I didn't think I could ever love anyone as much as I love you. But then you introduced me to the two funniest loving, carefree kids I have ever met. I can't wait to enjoy many more years of our beautiful family. Everyone knows our relationship got thrown through a loop when we found out about Grayson, but we made it work, and the way you love me and care for him is unbelievable. Oh my 
gosh. <laughs> yeah. Do you love it? Yeah. Do I look like your mom? More than my mom. Your mom? <laughs> With you. I feel safe, loved, beautiful, accepted, appreciated. You truly love me for me. Love me at my best, my worst. I want to marry you because marriage is hard. Blending our families is hard. You're the only person in this crazy world. I want to go through the good, bad, beautiful, and ugly with. Are you nervous? Yeah. Are you nervous? Yeah. Something perfectly well spin around like a child. Oh, and all of it. Logan, will you have this woman to be your wedded wife, to live together in holy matrimony? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep unto only unto her, so long as you both shall live? I do. Catherine, will you have this man to be your wedded husband, to live together in holy matrimony? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keeping only unto him, so long as you both shall it? I do. Logan and Catherine, you have consented together in holy wedlock, and have witnessed that before God in these witnesses. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. this guy for like my entire life. I'm Levi, I'm his little brother. His whole life, there's always been three things I knew that terrified him. That was being married, being a father, and you know that third thing, he's always been afraid of snakes like crazy. <laughs> forget when Catherine told me she was on Tinder and met Logan. I kind of I kind of told her like are you crazy? He could be a serial killer. It was one of my exact first lines to her. I remember on their first date when she went to Kansas City anyways, uh, we were telling her that she needed to put her tracker on her phone so that we could find her dead body later. <laughs> When she got back from that very first date, I knew that Logan was, was someone very special. Sis, you know I love you. You made one beautiful bride, and this turned out absolutely beautiful. And to that, I'm going to make a toast if you guys grab your drinks. And to the bride to have a happy life together, and cheers. <laughs> The love she has for you and the love you've had for her has, I've seen the change in you and just as I'm proud to call you my son, we're very proud to call Catherine now our daughter-in-law, Uriah and Adeline, our grands, along with Grayson. You know, th just thank you for being that light in his life and just don't ever forget how much you two love each other and I hope and pray you two get to live the longest, happiest life you can together and make all the memories you want to. And Catherine, welcome to the Clevengers. 